Hi guys and welcome to Helpful Solutions. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do project timeline in Excel. So if you use Excel and you have a project that is opened right now and you're working on it and you want to do a project timeline that is create a project timeline based on this data or you want to just add a chart and add data to it according to your preference. For that, the first option is simply click on the insert option at the top, then click on a smart art option here. So smart art graphics range from graphic lists and processes diagrams to more complex graphics such as Venn diagrams and organization charts. And you can use all those charts to create a project timeline that depicts all the data in a graphic way. For that, simply click on a smart art, then choose processes and then choose any one of these templates just right here. So I'm going to go with basic chevron process. So this basic chevron process is used to show a progression, a timeline sequential step in a task, processes or workflow. Or it is also used to emphasize movement or direction. Level 1 text appears inside an arrow and shape while level 2 text appears below the arrow shapes. So select basic chevron process and click on OK. After you click on OK, you will see a graphic appearing at your screen that will look something like this. Just place your mouse cursor at the line of this chart and left click, hold the left click and drag it to any part of your chart where do you want to place it. So here I'm keeping this just right here. And now at the toolbar you will see you are into smart art design. Here you can select any one of these formats for the graph that you entered. So I'm selecting this one. Now you can also change the colors. For example, I want it to be blue and you can also change the smart art styles and that basically comes down to your preference whether you like it or not. So you can add any one of these styles. So I'm going to go with this one. Now in the text option, you can add any of the data that you want to enter. For example, I want to enter level one. Now level two, you can enter right here. You can add any of these texts just right here and that will be a good representation of your timeline data. Now if you don't want to add it, simply select it and press delete on your keyboard. Now if you want to add a timeline according to this data that is just right here, for that select the amount of data that you want to enter as a timeline graph and here is the data that I want to be contained into my chart. So I'm selecting this data and click on the insert option at the top. Now go to this part that is recommended chart. Click on recommended chart, then click on all charts. After clicking on all charts, you can select any one of these or simply click on X, Y scatter. Now you can select any one of these chart designs that you want to have. So I'm selecting this one and click on OK. Now you'll see a chart that has been automatically made according to the data that we selected just right here. Now place this chart anywhere you want by left clicking it, holding it and dragging it to the part where you want to place it. So you can see right here, I just added this chart right here. You can also increase the size of this chart. Now I have a perfect project timeline in Excel. So that's the way through which you can add project timeline in Excel. Like and subscribe if you found this video helpful.